Hello and welcome back to Rob's PC Workshop. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a crossover cable. You'll need some uh, terminating, a terminating tool. You'll need some wire clippers, cutters. You'll need connector ends and you'll need a piece of wire and you want to cut this to the length you're going to need. Uh, the, the shorter the better. Uh, they can only go so long before they start uh, uh, not sending a, a clean signal. So first thing you're going to do, you take your terminators and they have a wire a stripper on them. We're going to strip our wire. So you'll put your wire into this end and the cutter goes down so far. Make about three twists. Open up your terminator and pull your plastic off. Now that you got your plastic off, you're going to want to go ahead and start uh, untwisting your wiring. And if you watch my first video on making uh, straight through, You'll notice that uh, one side of a crossover is the same, so that'll show you how to make a straight through. And then <clears throat> the only difference is at your end it crosses over. So when you go to your other end, you'll want to make sure you're following your cross crossed over side. So you'll take your, it'll go orange white, orange, green white, blue white. Green, white, blue, white, blue, green, brown, white, brown. So you do your best, get your wires nice and straight. And I like to mess with them to get them to go as straight as I can get them. And then you'll get them in order, tight as you can. And you'll take your connector and you'll measure out to make sure that it's going to fit in there correctly. As you can see the plastic can only go in so far. So you measure it out like so. And you'll clip your ends to make sure that they're going to go all the way to the very end of the, the RJ45 connector. And then you'll want to make sure you're, you're in the right order. So orange, white, orange, green, white. Orange, white, orange, green, white, blue, white. Green, white, green, green, white, blue, white, blue, green, blue, green, brown, white. And you can look this up on the internet. It has all the information if you decide you want to make your own crossword cables. Exactly how to do them, how to make sure they're in nice, neat order. So we'll get our connectors as good as we can in order, like so. You want to hold them down nice and tight. And you'll play with them and play with them until you get them like you want them. And then you'll again make sure your number one is this left side. Your clip is away from you. Once you get them nice and tight, you'll slide the, uh, thing, the connector down onto them, making sure they're all about the same length. And you push them as far in as you can, making sure they all come as close to the end as you can. Because when you crimp it down, <clears throat> These little com metal connectors will um, push down and uh, go into the wiring to make a good tight connection. And then you'll take your crimpers or your uh, terminator. As you can see, the 8P is the correct connector. And you'll make sure one is up and you will put it in just like so. And then you crimp down and it'll push all these pins into place. And then you can test your wire to make sure that you've made a good crossover. Uh, and that's making a crossover. Thanks. Have a nice day.